All right, guys, and welcome back to the channel. So a little bit of a windy day today. I'm sure you can hear it. But I heard a couple loud bangs when I was out and about. And I think this is lifting up and smacking back down. Yeah, this is making a bit of a noise to slap it up and down and stuff like that. So I want to secure it. Kind of did a modification after I uh, put my panels on here. It was kind of one of those things where I want to get this first. Wasn't sure how I was going to attach that. So I want to take another look at it. Might have to put a piece of wood or something like that just to kind of give it a transition and try to get it back into the metal up here somehow. So we'll kind of muck around with it, see what we can do. Alright, so I just got ahead and doctored up a jig here for my uh, wind meter and stuff like that. Going to hook it up and uh, maybe just go and check a couple spots around the, uh, the area. Put my GoPro on the end of it so I can kind of read it as we're walking around and see what it's like. Check it out. Alright, so I got my jig set up here and just going to do a little tour. Kind of heading to the front, pointing to the north. East. South West. Yeah, we'll go and check a couple different spots around the property, see what we come up with. Side of the house pointing south. It's crazy. It's crazy. East corner of the property looking south into the back campground and the lake. Back by the staircase. Point north. East. South. West. Should be a lot less here because we were a little lower. Not really feeling much of a wind now, obviously. Is that zeros? All right, so we checked a couple spots around. It was pretty much the same everywhere. You know, maximum got to like 17, 18 kilometers an hour. You know, it definitely felt like it was breezier than that. Probably is higher up, you know. Uh, be nice to have one of those wind socks and I'd know exactly where to point to get the most accurate reading for the highest amount of uh, wind so